When you rise one day and your dream greets you, you know that you have lived. <laughs> the story of the Batwa uh, takes us right back to Egypt. They are the forest pygmies. One of the oldest references is from an Egyptian text. The Batwa used to come from the mountains of the moon to come and sing to the pharaohs in Egypt. So uh, not only did, uh, did I think that the voices and the dancing of, of these people were quite appealing, but it appealed to the, to the pharaohs in Egypt too. We'll be voyaging very soon to uh, this region, it's close to Aswan in Egypt, because researching the Batwa story brought us to a very interesting uh, addition to the tale. There was a nobleman, uh, an Egyptian nobleman, thousands of years ago, who found a pygmy man, and he informed the pharaoh that he was bringing him this little pygmy man. This story is written on one of the, the tombs along the Nile. And uh, we want to go and try to see uh, this tomb and uh, to take an Egyptologist to come and read the, the hieroglyphs to us if we can. That's where we were last time. Is your mic on? Yeah. 